Hey everyone, it's Becca again. Um, I have a little prompt too that says uh, Dre Millman has met Jada Siegel. This is going to be the second part of the last video. I didn't realize that my camera cut me off because it had full memory. So I um, went and moved some of the moved the video into the computer, and there was a ton of photos on the SD card that I had, so I moved them too. But we're still on the same day, and Derek is eating his um, cereal right now. Um, Cheryl's still at work. Daniel and... The alarm's going off. Um, Daniel and the other children are still at school, but this is... Um, um, Derek's first large house fire so I know I've showed it in the past but on this video this is going to be Derek's first because I told you I had to restart because my computer wouldn't turn on but I asked about my computer yesterday and the lady said that it's still with Dell they're still working on it because they were waiting for a new motherboard because the motherboard and the computer went so when that's get shit back in I'll be able to play on that one but for right now we have to play on this one so it says Daniel's carpool will be coming in an hour cause they left school now and I'm gonna have I'm gonna jump over to Derek at, cause he's on his way to the fire and if you didn't see one of my first videos then this will be the first large house fire you've seen him put out because um, he, this is his first one so far in this in this game trilogy thing. That's whatever you want to call it. Videos. So um, if you've never done this and haven't seen my first video, um, I'm gonna zoom out a little bit. And if you see right here on this window, there is a fire. You have to go around the house and extinguish the fires in the windows first before you can break into the house and I'm just gonna click on the windows that he has to extinguish which seems to only be those two so after he does that then he can break into the house but right now he has to wait until he's done with those so let's uh, fast forward a little bit to get him to do those Okay, so here he is putting out the window, and it says, This fire is simply horrible, the most terrifying thing I've ever experienced. Please save my home and my family. So, and he just got a opportunity completed, and he wants to buy a water slide now, so I guess we're going to give him that. And Cheryl's still at work. And, um, Daniel is off to work, and Tanisha is already at work. And it says, sorry about all the pausing, but it says, Cheryl earned $138 today, and Dre got on the honor roll. And Cheryl got a promotion. It says, congratulations, Cheryl's impressive performance has earned her promotion to par paramedic, as well as a bonus of $300. Finally, some hand on some hands-on medical care. Paramedics are first on the scene to provide emergency care, so it's important for you to touch up on logical reasoning so that the split-second decisions you make are the correct ones. It says she now makes $28 an hour and works from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m., which is an hour later in the morning and an hour later at, so like it pushes back her when she has to be to work and when she leaves work. But that's okay because the kids are pretty much grown up, so they don't really need their mom at home 24-7. But, um, Courtney and Casey are at home, and Charlotte and Dre are on the school bus, and it says Cheryl has got a promotion, and I'm going to pause because now that he's done with the windows, putting out the window fires, now we have to click on the door and choose, well, I don't know why it's not letting me choose it, but... Well, it won't let me choose it, but he just like ran through the door anyways. So, he's got
gonna extinguish the fires on the inside of the house also. Which, he's right there. You can kind of see him. Maybe I can zoom in a little bit. Alright. Zoomed in. There he is. Putting out the fire with his fire extinguisher. And... Let's see... Um... Okay, um, I'm gonna jump over to Courtney, cause she's at home and she's not doing anything, so... I'm gonna jump over to her and she's actually really tired, so I think I might have her go upstairs and sleep for a little while and catch and get a little bit of sleep before she does her homework. And the same thing with Casey, cause she's like almost ready to pass out. So, let's have her sleep also. And Charlotte is really tired too, but she actually has a lifetime wish of the Tinkerer, which means that you have to master the handiness and the logic skill. So, um, let's see. I'll give her that because I don't have anyone that has it yet. And I like to try and do different lifetime rewards for the families because if you keep doing the same one, it just gets boring. So let's have her sleep there. And when Dre gets home, he needs to shower. And shower, and we'll have him clean it too. And then we'll have him work on his homework. And Cheryl is home, and we're going to have her, hmm, let's see, I think there's bad food, so we're going to have her clean out the bad food, and I was going to say let's have her do laundry, but we're going to have to wait, so we'll have her watch TV then after she's done with that, so we'll have her watch TV, and, um, press play, and just let them do that while Derek's down extinguishing the flames in the household of the house where the large house fire is. And there's, that's Casey and Cheryl. And if you haven't realized, I name all the girls with C's and all the boys with D's to follow the parents' names. I thought it was something different that I could do. So that's one thing that I, that I did. And, um... Let's see. I'm going to pause it for a second again. Because I want to see... In... Um... I don't know how many more days. I'm... Hold on. I think in like... Four or five days, it's going to be Dre's birthday. I know... I've tried to explain this and say that I had to restart, so I had wrote and written down because I was having problems with my last PC, and I was worried that I was going to lose them, and I don't want to have to keep playing them over and over and over on the same age. So I'm pretty sure that Dre is going to be aging up in like th four or five days in-game. So that will be very shortly, which means that we need to get the, his bedroom upstairs completed so he can have his own bedroom like everyone else. And I just want to say this now just in case it cuts me off again because I don't know, like, this camera's new and I don't know how long this can record for. And I don't know how much space is on the SD card. So if it cuts me off, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. And um, I'll be making more videos because it's easier for me to use this camera than it was before to do to use the webcam that I had. It was really hard. And, um, just please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And please encourage other people to add to my, subscribe to my channel. Because I only have 16 people, um, on my, subscribe to my channel. So please, please, please have people subscribe. It would be really, really helpful if people subscribed. And I want to make a shout out quickly to RachM282 and say that I love um, her little foal. It's so cute. And Angel has grown to be such a beautiful young lady. And I can't wait to see 